What's that? Ah! Th that's one of the monsters that attacked Halor! A survivor, huh? If we leave it here, it'll surely go back and try to attack Halor again. But Halor has the barrier protecting it now. Even so, how are the people of Halor supposed to sleep at night when beasts like this crawling around just outside the barrier? easy. Now Halor is safe as well. I don't know. Hmm. Okay, sure. Oh, I feel so powerful! What the heck? It, it hardly put up a fight! But there could be a dozen more just around the corner. N no worries! Seriously! Well, let's just hope there aren't too many more where it came from.
Before, but I've never seen it up close like this. Well, people don't usually travel outside the barriers. If we keep going, we can see all sorts of things, like the jungle or the city of waterfalls. There are so many more things we could learn, if only our journey would continue. I guess it's true. I really was living in a small world. That's a rare moment of sincerity coming from you. It's your first time seeing it too, right? Well, yes, but... Aww, you must have had such a lonely life, tied to your research like that. Having you pity me makes me want to jump off this cliff. This water has traversed the world's oceans and has seen all there is to see. The ocean binds the lands of our world together. Here she goes again. It's really just one big puddle, you know. Whatever, you were pretty moved back there too. Huh? <laughs> so this is the world as he sees it. Yuri? Flynn must have stood on this spot earlier. And looked out at the same scene. That's true. His duties do take him to many different places. Always telling me to catch up with him. Easy for him to say. Nor Harbor is just around the corner from Emmett Hill. We'll catch up to him in no time. That's not what I was talking about. Huh? What do you mean? All right, let's get moving before LeBlanc and friends show up again. Just follow the ocean road to the west after leaving here to get to Nor Harbor. We can't miss it. We'll have plenty more chances to see the ocean. Your journey will continue for as long as you want. <sighs> it's all up to you. You've made it this far, haven't you? That's true. Last one down's a rotten egg! You're gonna fall if you don't watch out. Oh! <laughs> Idiot. Let's get this over with. That was awesome! That's nice, but I 
can do so much more. We got a head start. All right, let's go. Go to It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Uh, I'm gonna do it! Man, I was just getting warmed up. I'm gonna make you work. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Hey, I learned something. These are the threads that weave our future. Guess we can do this. Man, I was just getting warmed up. What's this? Oh, that's a camping set. With this, you can set up camp and sleep without having to go to an inn. Oh, that's nice. Now you can go off and play Nature Boy whenever we sleep at an inn. And we'll save money, too. W what are you talking about? Camping sets are single use only. Rita, don't be so mean. Hmm. Huh. That sounds really useful, Carol. Yeah. They're essential when you're on the road. In addition to camping sets, you could also sleep on mats. But camping sets are really the best thing to use. You can't get a better night's sleep with anything else. What wonderful timing. All of you look so exhausted from climbing. You look pretty pooped yourself. Yeah, we've got a ways to go before we get to town, too. Maybe we should set up camp here. All right. I'll get everything set up. Oh, once you've camped somewhere, you won't be able to camp around there for a while afterwards. 
Why's that? After camping at a certain site, the basic barrier that's included in the camping set will stop being effective for a while, so long as you're near that site. Basic barrier? What's that? There's no Blastia like that. It's not a Blastia, actually. It's just something that gives off a smell that monsters find unpleasant. That's why they call it a barrier. It can keep the monsters at bay for a night. But after enough time passes, the monsters get used to the smell, and it won't keep you safe anymore. Hmm, that makes sense. Well then, we'll leave the setup to you, Carol. All right, let's set up a camp a little bit further.